All right, here's a quick Impala video because it seems like everyone likes the Impala. It's been sitting outside a couple snowstorms. Yes. Going around. I've been working on, of course, Trailblazer. Thing I point out, like I mentioned, spraying the bulls with WD-40 is going to help because they're kind of starting to corrode up from the rain, which I don't really like. The rotors are. But sometimes you just can't help it. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to fire it up, let it run, and go take it around the block and knock some of that uh, rust off. So the other thing is I picked up some WD-40. And once it's rust and everything's knocked off, I'm going to spray it down. But, let's start this guy up. <sighs> Kinda didn't want to. I'm gonna go ahead and let this thing run for a few minutes, let it get warmed up, and then we'll go for a ride. So, it's idling pretty decent now. We'll take it for a nice little spin. Now, normally I don't drive this on the roads after we've had snow and salt trucks have come by, but we actually recently got a rain. Kind of rinsed the whole roads and everything off, and now they're dried off. No salt stains on it, so. Usually what I do would wait for it in the springtime anyways. I wait for a good rain to wash off all the salt off the road. So not too worried about driving this thing in these kind of conditions. Okay, we are coming out onto main drag here. Got a couple cars coming. But uh, yeah, we'll uh, get out of here a little bit and see what she does. Warm her up. Just a touch. Gotta make sure things stay stay proper. Oh, that was a fresh kill for a deer. So I already noticed this thing. The tires are kind of doing this number. I've got a couple flat spots on them from um, just sitting month that it has been so definitely uh, don't like that you know like I like to do put on jack stands and try to get it up in the air but got other projects you got to make room and do with what you got so it really kind of baffles me how people can drive these things in the winter time all the time I mean I drove a Caprice but it was very uh, winterized, winter tires, full of rust holes and everything. Just didn't really uh, a rear-wheel drive vehicle. I mean, it slid all over the road. It just wasn't really fun. So when I see people that have Impalas and they say, oh, I drive them in mild snow, and that uh, just seems odd. All right, let's see if we can do this.
Not a bad little peely. Not a bad little peely at all. So just a short little one. Do some burnouts, you know, all the good stuff. All right, see you later. I'm back. Nice and sticky. Got a little bit of tire gunk on there. Well, it's not too bad. Well, what about the other side? That's the important part. Oh, shined up those rotors like nothing. <laughs> nice. So, that's going to do it. Just a quick little beep boop. Get my last little summer jitter hurrah out of the Impala. Yeah, I love that car. See you later.